everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So this is very different to what I normally do but I was actually planning on doing something else and I don't know how this happened but this has happened. So I went, oh, I went with it anyway but this is like a little mini um, festival look um, if you will. Um, festival season will be upon us very soon and I probably won't have time to do a festival makeup at that time so I'm making up for it now but um this is super easy to create, so if you want to see how I got it, then just keep on watching. Now off, I'm going to use the Beautiful Brow Powder in the shade Chocolate, and I'm going to use that on both of my brows with um, an angled brush. For concealer on the eye, then I'm going to use the Essence Camouflage um, Concealer in the shade Light Ivory. And to pat that on, I'm using a Sosu SKD brush, the 06, the small flat brush. I'm then going to go in with the Stacey Marie Be Perfect Carnival palette. And I want to go with colours that I wouldn't normally use. So I'm going to go in with the blue colours here. For the first blue shade, I'm going in with another Sosu um, SKD um, brush. It's the 021. So I'm patting that shadow on. And this is the shade Sky. To blend out the outer shadow, I'm going to go in with a Buff and Blend BB12. And it's a smaller blending brush. Next, I'm going to go in with a darker shade of blue. So the shade Mood. So the blue shade I have just put on is Sky. That's that one there. And I'm going to go into Mood now. So it's a dark navy. And on that one, I'm going in with a pencil brush. And this is, again, the Sosu XK one number four. And I'm just patting that into the outer corner. Again, I'm blending that out with the small blending brush. I like to take a step back from my makeup as well, just so I can see it from further away. Because sometimes you're too close to your project, so it's nice to take a step back and see it from further away. I'm going to go back in with the Camouflage Essence Concealer. And with the little brush that I use, the SK06, and I'm just going to put the crease. And I'm just patting this on. Towards the edge, as you'll see, I'm not patting it on any longer. I'm kind of smudging it out just so that you don't see like a straight line of concealer and then a straight line of shadow. I want to blend them together. On another flat brush, the SK061, I'm going to go into the shade um, Mooney, this white shade here, and I'm hoping this will pop. And again, I've just patted that shadow on. Now I'm going to go back in with my pencil brush, so the SK04 in the shade Mood, the second blue shade. And I'm just going to go right underneath my crease line here on my lash line. Just to darken that up. And I'm going to blend out again with the first blending brush. So what goes up must come down. So I'm going to go in to the, use the pencil brush again and go into the shade Mood and just go right close to the lash line on the bottom part. I have applied the mood shade again just underneath the lash line and now I'm going to go into sky the lighter blue shade and just smoke it out with that and for that again I'm using the SK02 so I'm just blending out here now with the buff and blend um, BB12 and again I'm going to go in with the white shade so the moony shade and I'm going to put that on the inner corner of my eye for mascara, I'm going to use the Benefit Roller Lash. Okay, so I'm just patting blue, the first blue shadow of the sky into my waterline. For foundation, I'm going to use the Carter Beauty Foundation. It's the HD one in the shade Creme Brulee. And this is just a random flat brush that I have. Um, there's no name on it or anything like that. It must have been a little set that I bought yonks ago and um, I will be taking this foundation off once I film this video so it doesn't matter if it stays on long or not okay so I have changed my mind I was going to do a completely different look and now um, I'm landed with this 
Um, I do like it, so I'm going to roll with it. So I just filmed my other eyebrow off the camera, and now I'm going to do the exact same to this eye that I have done to this eye. Um, this is what happens. I have an idea in my head, and then something happens that I'm like, hmm, I'm going to do something else. So I will be back in a moment. I'm just going to do to this eye what I've done to this one, so I will see you in a moment. Ta-da! Okay, so I have my two eyes done now. So now I'm going to um, stick on some of these sequins on my face. And I'm going to do that using duo glue. Now I'm going to use my water activated paints. And I'm going to um, just add some detail above the brow and underneath this eye. I was going to use my number 76 gel liner, but I'm actually going to use the white face paint instead. I think it'll give me more of a messier look. So the brush I'm going to use is actually, I have two of them, but they're from one of the seven nail packs that I got. Remember, um, if you watch my deals haul, I buy a little pack of nail um, art brushes and um, these are the ones that were in it. So I'm going to use these. Again, I'm going to use a blue water activated paint this time. Um, I'm going to use that for my lips. This I'm also using a one of the brushes that came from that set. So on top of that, I'm just putting the shade Recharge on with my finger. And I just popped off some lashes there off camera. I actually bought these lashes off AliExpress and I got five packs for like one euro. So that's always good. But you see how dramatic that is now with the lash on. They're obviously twice too big. Um, what I would say is like obviously there's no glue on them. But they're um, very big so you probably will have to cut them. But again for a euro how could you go wrong so that is the finished look i took off, took off the lashes again there because i'm not going to stick those on that is a super simple festival look if anybody is interested festival season will be upon us very soon and probably around the time that it's on i will not have a chance to do anything like this so um i said why not try and do it today my hair is all over the place obviously if i was going to a festival i wouldn't have it like this but anyway this is what we're doing for the video this look was super simple to create. It was literally three eyeshadows and sticking on a bit of stuff. So it is really easy to create a cool festival look. If you're going to a festival look and you are interested in seeing some more of these looks, then just comment down below and I will do more of them. Um, I don't know how I feel about the blue lip. I think it's just too strong. I feel like more of like a rock star or something more so than festival. But um, other than that, I like the... I like this. I like the eye area um, but yeah thank you so so much for watching and if you would like to see more of these then just like comment subscribe and all that kind of stuff but until then see you in my next one